Welcome to my channel. My name is Daniel. And today we're gonna review what you're gonna be inside on this box from Banggood. Oh, it's too sunny over here. I think this, this is the address for a registration product or something like that. This is the code. It's exactly the same code like in Bangor. No, over here the same. The same code. RC boat heli watt meter digital LCD display D660 volts and 100 amps battery power. Okay, let's just open up and let's take a look. I ordered this one from Banggood for my RC project for quadcopter and uh, a wing plane. What they're gonna build soon. Oh, this is very weird here. The display is it's not in the place. I don't know why. It's just a little bit up. And also here the connection, they are not in the place. I don't know if it's working. I hope, yes. Let me attach something on this and I will come back now. Okay. Just find this battery and let me focus here a little bit. And let's see. It's really start up or not? Oh, it says wait. Okay, it's working. Now I have to open this or I have to send it back and wait to send me another one, Bangod, for I don't know how many days I have to wait again. I think better I will gonna open those four screw and those four screw and I'm just gonna move it a little bit down because I think from the from the ship shipment when they send me on this small bag and also this kind of things and I think it was shaking inside and that's why yeah let me find my my screw if I I'm gonna find my tools here. Oh, okay, I just find my tool. And now let's just, I think from the other side it's much better. Hmm. It's down. Actually it's up. My, my advice, I think it's better to open it than send it back and just for for this, if you receive something like this and you know what you're doing like me it's better to open it just like this and move it a little bit down or up or depends in which way it's go then send it back to Banggood from whatever country it is yeah. I think it's not enough. Uh, I don't know how you call them. This like foam on on this to keep it in place because it doesn't have anything over here. Just a aluminum box. I think I'm gonna put something over here, uh, something like this, or I think I have something else. If you order from Bangalore, 
eBay or some, you have a lot of foam like this. Uh, cut a piece from this one. Just a small one, not big, big. You don't need a big one. Just like so. I think it's a big, too much. Yeah. And put it right here. And just push it back. Okay, because now we will open it. Let's take a look. Also. Output, input. Have a protection. It's better to leave it there. And I saw a lot of video on YouTube about this and they say there are four of those inside but I have just one I don't know how is that and just take a close look and I have two of those they write on top of them they say it's now you cannot see it it's air Zero zero two. I don't know what that means. Anyway, yeah, let's put it together, and we just finish with this. Okay, after you cut a small piece foam, put it right here. Uh, not, not so close of this way. Because maybe if you use it for 60 watt, uh, 60, 60 volts, and let's say 19 or 80 amps, this wire gonna get hot, very very hot, and that is not good because you know it's not good. Now let me see if I can put it back. just like this and I don't have to take and the other part out just uh, the upside part of the top Don't forget about the foam and don't forget to put it far from this wire, not close, just a little bit far from that wire, just like so, you see, far. Okay, after I fight with this for a couple of minutes, I just figured out how to put it back. Uh, when you take it out, and this part, they say here source and load, you have to remember how you put it, because you're gonna be in the other way around, you're gonna destroy this. We're gonna put the load, the source here, and the load here. But it's in the other way around. How to find out which one? Let's go with where. You can take a pictures. You can note or by this. You find these three pins. It mean is the source side, and this is the load from K coming in from his going out okay now 
with the problem we have it before here because it doesn't stay and it's going up also uh, I don't know if it's good or bad but those can touch the aluminium down so stick it a little bit inside just a little bit and here you can cut from here not so much but just like so to put it right here on, on this side here and there you go now it's just in the place how it have to be and it's okay for I don't know how many 12 euro and 62 cents I think so yes yeah 12 euro and 62 cents with free shipping from Banggood from Europe Banggood warehouse yep. Now it's okay and yes it's in place. Now it's just there. Let me take out this protection because I don't need it. Here you have the manual. It's come with the watt meter and it's in English. Not have to be in English, everything. Let's say the range, resolution, note. and so on. The other side the same. Also they have the code where you can scan this. I think so you find something on the website. I'm not sure exactly. This is a watt meter and Let's test it one more time if it's working. I don't have nothing yet to put in the load, but I think it's working perfectly. Sorry. This is the watt meter. Zero zero point zero 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 amps. Zero point zero zero amps. Volts. Eight point nine watts known. Okay. This is the watt meter. This is the box and the package and everything inside and I just show you if you receive it with some problems like me, the display is up or it's down, I just show you how to resolve that and you don't have to send it back to, mm, to Banggood, eBay or Amazon or from where you buy it because it's, it's it's good to send it back to give it another one but you're gonna wait too much for that you're gonna wait another a week or two or maybe a couple of days just because you have to take out four screw and you just slide a little bit down and put some foam inside over there and
just gonna be like like normal like a new one just gonna send you back and also if they're gonna send you back another one and on the on the way back on you you're gonna receive it again maybe you're gonna be in the same box and you're gonna shake the same they're gonna throw the box in the post they don't they don't care when they deliver it and you're gonna be the same you're gonna have the same problem you're gonna wait another three weeks for that no I, I think it's not it's not a good idea just open it put something over there move it up and down and that's it yeah thank you for watching subscribe like the video if you like what I'm doing and see you next time